uh, these dogs were not on the loose. They were all on leashes getting walked. But when the retriever passed the pit bulls, they attacked. Luckily, David Bliss was driving by in his school bus at the very same time. I'm coming back from my bus run. And what do you see? The answer is a dog attack. These two pit bulls mauling a golden retriever. They both had the dog in their mouth and they were just tearing, just, just pulling and pulling. There were no kids on the bus at the time. David says that he had finished his final run and he was just heading back to the district garage. But that's when he came upon the attack and instinct took over. I come up here and I yanked uh, the emergency brake on the bus, the air brakes, and and uh, jumped out and I landed on top of the dogs and I just started wailing on them. Bliss got on the ground and showed us exactly what he did. I was laying on top of them like this when I got on top of them and they had her ears and they had her neck and they were just just turning her one way and then another. And so I'm just pounding away and pounding away and I had my, my uh, my right knee was on the chest of the one. The pit bulls were only attacking the retriever, but the retriever's owner was on the ground just feet away with her grandchild. After one punch to the brown dog's throat, Bliss says both pit bulls let go. His bottom lip was scratched, his right hand bit through. Yeah, yeah, they went in this side here with the uh, top jaw here and the bottom jaw down here. David Bliss says he doesn't remember thinking about what he did. It was pure instinct. But no regrets about... Oh, absolutely doing none. It. Absolutely none. Nope. I'd do it again tomorrow. In a heartbeat. The pit bulls are quarantined in cages at their home. There's a hearing on what to do with them in 10 days. The Humane Society in Ontario County told us the owner of the pit bulls, Rose Burnett, is getting charged with two counts of harboring a dangerous dog. The retriever uh, was uh, bit, has a bite wound on its neck and on its uh, ear. Uh, it's back home tonight, safe. Uh, we tried to talk to the uh, the owner of the, the Golden Retriever, Retriever mm -hmm. but she wasn't home today. We couldn't reach her. And you say a hearing's coming up in 10 days. What could happen to the pit bulls? Could they be put down? It's possible, but uh, the threshold for that is extremely high. Um, the it would have to be proved to the judge that, and I'm quoting here, uh, the pit bulls caused serious physical injury to the human and or the companion animal. The pit bulls did not bite the retriever's uh, owner or the grandchild. So the animal experts I talked to say it's more likely the order will have something to do with containing the dogs on their property. Just amazing to hear that bus driver recount this experience. Berkeley, thank you. Sure. Thank you.